as soon as that door goes, his tail will just go back and forth, back and forth, and he is so excited to see Dad. Doug and his dad are very close. Oh. Doug's dad will jump in the pool and then Doug will follow him. He just wanted to play with his dad all the time. And sometimes he will be cuddled up next to me. What is it? And he'll stand up and then he will just go to his dad. Should get your bed. But when we first got Doug, I felt like we wasn't ready. I was actually at work when my partner, he rang me and said, shall we get a dog? 20 minutes later, he said, come outside. He had Doug in his car. <laughs> as soon as I saw him, I just picked him up and I fell in love with him instantly. Oh, you do. <laughs> and I was like, we are not getting rid of him. Oh, <laughs> From day one, we just had a really good connection with him. He's so tired, aren't you? 90% of the time, he would just come and sit and cuddle with me. But we went through the teenage stage when he grew up a little bit more. <laughs> and then I first noticed Doug getting close with my partner. Oh, he loves that. <laughs> he was just with his dad all day, every day. And they just grew closer and closer. Oh now, Doug and his dad are partners in crime. <laughs> Doug's dad is like the cool dad you get on a school playground. He lets him get away with more. Whereas with me, he doesn't have as much of a playful side, but he does have that respect and he will listen to me at all times. So I love the bond that Doug and his dad have, and I literally love watching them. <laughs> but Doug will always be a mummy's boy. I can't even describe how close we are. We are inseparable. He loves constant fusses, constant head scratches. He just wants to sleep with me all the time and it really warms my heart. Me and Doug have the best bond ever. I just wouldn't change him for the world. <laughs>